Well, May is Stroke Awareness Month, but the signs and symptoms are something people should keep in mind all year round. Dr. Michael Savilla joins us now with more on what you should do, what you should know. And good morning, Dr. Savilla. Good morning. Well, tell us first of all, what's the impact of a stroke on uh, on uh, people here in the United States and across the the world? Now, an interesting uh, statistic that I ran into in doing some research on this is every 40 seconds in the United States, someone mm -hmm. suffers a stroke, which uh, ends up being almost 800,000. Um, strokes a year in the United States mm -hmm. um, and every four minutes someone passes away from a stroke so it's it's a big impact disease and uh, it could affect anybody is that right is there is does it target one person or another well some higher risk groups are, are people uh, with uh, sugar diabetes mm -hmm. um, people who have heart disease heart problems heart attacks um, and uh, people with blood pressure problems so those are those are the, the main uh, risk factor groups that we uh, focus on does it matter uh, age-wise can any any age uh, uh, get a stroke um, yeah any age can get a stroke but as we do get older um, uh, that we do have an increased tendency to get blood pressure and maybe blood sugar problems so they do kind of go together mm -hmm. now there are some uh, warning signs to uh, to to tell if you're gonna have a stroke or not mm -hmm. what are some of the warning signs the most important thing to, to, to know is that uh, if symptoms come up uh, very suddenly so it could be uh, uh, difficulty with speaking mm -hmm. difficulty with walking uh, numbness on one side of the uh, of the body um, and uh, the, the symptoms don't have to be very severe they could be very subtle uh, but they are very sudden and something um, not uh, 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 something that we have to really recognize so that it can be uh, treated uh, appropriately. Mm -hmm. Now what uh, should you do if uh, you think you might be uh, fall into that group that that is uh, that could get a stroke. Uh, what, mm -hmm. what are some of the things that you can do to help prevent it? Yeah, prevention is, is very important. Uh, if, if you do have high blood pressure, to have your blood pressure uh, treated uh, adequately, what we look for is a blood pressure between 120 over 80. Mm -hmm. If you do have blood sugar problems, to make sure that's under control. If you have cholesterol problems, to make sure that's under control. Mm -hmm. But the most important thing for prevention is to recognize those signs and symptoms early so you can get treated uh, uh, at the hospital. All right, Dr. Savelle. Thank you very much. We'll get uh, more information from you in our next hour on this subject. Appreciate it. Great.